Best of Hatred, all the skins, and a review. So, starting right off, this is actually a pretty cool looking one if people like VFX. It's almost like got like a lava effect. And it even has armor. So not only do you get the, the mount, but you get an armor and you get the trophy. I wish you could just buy like just this as the base. Is that even possible? But this is a really cool looking one, but this is like almost 30 bucks, right? Isn't that about like the ratio? Uh, then next up, we have another mount uh, over oh, here, God. the Dusk Walker. Wow, that looks pretty cool too. It's kind of like on fire. It almost reminds me of uh, one of the things from the campaign. <laughs> I'll, I'll try not to spoil it, but uh, it's, it's kind of cool. That was 25 and I wish you could, again, just, just buy the base of that one. I, I like that one even without the armor. Oh, we got some wild transcendence pretty cool uh for the base i almost like the stuff without the armor almost reminds me of kind of like a black panther anyways i'll give that one like a five out of ten and uh, this one i like this one with without any of the armor on it as well i like this one i'll give it like an eight but this one i think this one's pretty cool this is another eight out of ten uh and then i'm not sure if this one's new um, it didn't have the marker over it. I mean, it's new to me. This is kind of cool, actually. I'll give this one like an eight. It's like a mechanical horse. And then starting Powerful off guy. with the actual skins. Ooh, is this a Spiritborn one? I'm, I'm guessing, yeah, this is a Spiritborn one. And it has VFX. So this is 2,800. It's got a little bit of fan surface, a little bit in the back too. And then um, what else do you get over here? You get some extra tattoos. And then you get a cosmetic. It's got like lightning on it. That's pretty cool, honestly. I think this is a pretty decent uh, looking skin. I'll give that one like a six. My helmet's pretty cool too, yeah. Six or seven. I like it. It almost reminds me of Protoss with little orbs on it. And then what is this yeah, one, a rogue? It. It's called the Black Smoke. That's a pretty cool helmet. I think that I gotta give this one an eight. Usually I like armor that doesn't uh, cover you know all the goods. I like the fan service for the rogue, but this one actually looks kind of cool. And then we have, uh, what is this one? Is this Barbarian? Bold choice. I think this is a Barbarian skin right here, right? This one's got so many, like, spikes everywhere. It's kind of cool looking, though. <laughs> why, why does the end of the, like, shoes look like this, though? It looks like they'd just get caught on everything. And then we get a weapon over here. Oh, you know what? I didn't check the Rogue one. I wish you could just buy some, some of the stuff individually, but this is 2600 uh, I'll give this one, like... A seven. I, I like it. It's kind of cool. But uh, my bet on the road, we didn't get to check out the weapon. Ah, on very it. good. Yeah, I think the rogue one is pretty cool too. Yeah, I think we give the, yeah, the I th think we give the rogue an eight. And then is what is this? Selection. Uh, is this another barbarian one? I think this is another barbarian. Oh wait, was this druid right here? Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, th that's barbarian. And then this one is also barbarian. They give him Barb all the skins, but I don't know if Barb's going to be so hot this season. So this one, I feel like th this one's really similar to like some of the things that we've had in the battle pass. I'll give this one like a six. It doesn't look bad. It's just, I feel like we've already gotten one that was very similar. Um, I forgot the, the names of it. Oh, yo, Shadow, thank you so much for becoming a member. Welcome indeed, mates. Oh, wait, there's free gifts. Hey, guys, there are free things to claim. Cool. Oh, okay, it's gonna probably take forever. I'm gonna, I'll claim it later. Oh, uh, whoops. Make sure you guys claim some of these now. Uh, for, for the sake of the video, I'm not gonna claim it because it's gonna keep on doing that every single time. It's gonna do a little, little animation. But the reason why, sometimes for these like things, there are like limited time, like it's like a week only, but we can like at least. Wow, this is a really cool one. Is this a two-handed sword or is it one-handed? It's just a regular sword. Okay, this this for a free thing? I want to give this one like a nine. It looks really cool. I didn't know that... I don't... Are they giving us free cosmetics because like the servers were down? This is a pretty cool skin too. That's like a nine. It's probably one of the coolest looking axes. It's got like a chain. It's got like blood on it too. I like this one. Really, really cool. But kind of impractical because like you couldn't put one of your hands right here because it's got spikes. Yeah, it's like a nine out of ten for looks, but we got it like... We gotta maybe subtract like three or four because this is like really bad. Uh, it, if it just had spikes over here, it's you still wouldn't want it. It, I don't know. I just think that it's a little bit bad in terms of like practicality, even though I know it's like a game. Uh, anyways, I think that, oh wait, this is a newer one too. You know what, this might, might be a newer one to me or is it just new in general? I don't know. It has a little icon 
This looks crazy. I've never seen this. It almost reminds me of the monk, because it's got, like, that orange color scheme. This straight up should have been a monk skin. Uh, I mean, obviously, we don't have a monk in the game. This looks too weird, though, for Diablo. I don't know. Do you guys like the little eye? I mean, it's definitely wild. <laughs> I don't know. It kind of looks mean to me. I don't know. I want to give this one a five. It's got some potential with, like, the monk armor. I like that. But then the eyes just don't... I don't know. Maybe... Maybe it's supposed to be something else from another game. Ooh, this is cool, too. This game got, like, it like almost looks like kind of like dreads. I'll give this one, like, a 7 or 8. This is kind of cool. I wish it didn't have a little lantern. I wish it was just, like, fire on it so you can see the skeleton because they rendered that part out. Cool. What's called the Scarecrow? Okay. Uh, and let's see what else. The Hungry Some Devil? Selection. This is basically the one that we had with the Barbarian, but now it's on Rogue. Ooh, I like this one. I want to give this one like an 8 or a 9. I like this one a lot. It's pretty cool. Oh, you know what? My bad, guys. Sorry. I forgot to go check out the weapons on this. I didn't it check out the weapons. You, yes. I don't know. I just feel like it It looks... I think that kind of works. I don't know. For some reason, it's just the... I think it's the helmet. It almost looks like it's googly eyes. <laughs> like, it's, like it's too mean. So anyways, I gave that one a 5. That's I didn't so see the weapons on this one. I like this one a lot. Oh, it's oh, it's Halloween themed. Okay, yeah, yeah, I like this one. This one's like an easy eight out of ten. All right. Anyways, next up for the rogue one, the weapons. Ooh, that's pretty cool. It's got the size. Yeah. Oh, that thing. That's so cool. I might actually have to get this one. I like the armor too. How are the tattoos? Usually, I don't really care about looking at the tattoos, but I know this one was going to be cool. It is pretty cool. Although I don't know if you can really even see the tattoos. Oh, it's even got ninja stars. Dang, I might have to give this one, like, a 10, man. This is probably one of the coolest skins in the entire game. I like this one a lot on the Barbarian. But yeah, the Hungry Devil, very, very cool skin. And then for That's the Sorcerer, the uh, it's called the Lumin the Luminari. Where's where's the triangles? It was supposed to be, like, Luminari. You know what? This one is similar to that Spiritborn one that we actually did see. I think it looks cooler on the Spiritborn. But I like the staff. It looks kind of cool. It's got kind of an Egyptian thing. But uh, I forgot what season it was. It, was it... The, like the no season of contract was after that um was it infernal hordes i think it was before whatever one we had before infernal hordes um i feel like it's very similar to the one that was on the battle pass right i don't, I don't remember the name of it but i'll give this one like a four i feel like it's too similar to the one that already existed on the battle pass all right and then next up we still have some more extra amounts the invis in invincible uh Aspect. This is kind of cool. You can see like the uh, like the rib cage. Cool. Oh, it's even got. Wait, is this got Frostmourne? That's a really cool sword. That's uh, from World of Warcraft. I like this one. I think that I'd give this one like a nine out of ten. It's really cool. All right, and then I think that that is it. Unless there's any other add-ons uh, that are brand new. I think we went over all of them. Oh, wait, hold on. Spiritborn. There's actually four extra skins for the Spiritborn guys. All right, let's check them all out. Starting off, ooh, this one's kind of cool. It's got claws. All right, let's check out the weapon. It's got like a hook on it. Woomba's pride. All right, so for this one, you, yes. I think I'll give it like a... It look, almost looks like a Nepalese, like in terms of like the armor, or like maybe even Tibetan. I like it. It's kind of cool. I'll give this one a seven. All right, next one over here, the Hunter's <laughs> Fire. Ooh, I like that shoulder armor. It looks really good, dang. But I really like my default one right now. I think this is probably the coolest one. I want to give this one a 9. Ooh, even the weapon looks good on this one. Not this one, though. This one's way cooler. Uh, the glaive. And then the, the tattoos, wow. They really did a really good job on the tattoos. Uh, th I think this is the coolest skin on Spiritborn so far. That one, that one, that one probably going to be a 10. Ooh, what is this one? This is like a kind of like a, a remix of the Sorceress one. I, I Sorry, I don't remember the exact name of every single one, but this is kind of a remix on the Sorceress one. It doesn't look bad. I feel like it doesn't really fit like the Spiritborn, like in terms of like the way it looks. Whereas like this one is definitely Spiritborn. Like it's got like the claws. It's got the gorilla. And then this one over here, it kind of fits like the Jaguar theme to an extent over here. And what is this one supposed to be? That's a bold choice. Huh. But let's check out the weapon on this. Okay. This looks like a crazy, like a futuristic sci-fi weapon or something. All right, the Devourer's Venom. Okay, so this is like the centipede one. 
Well, this looks like something that would be in like Warframe, if any of you guys have played that game. It's kind of cool. I'll give this one like a seven. Yeah, I, I think this this is the best skin. This is this is a ten out of ten skin. I might have to get it, but I'm gonna have to look at uh the. I don't know if there's anything else that we can get, but this is definitely one of the coolest skins. All right. Anyways, that's going to wrap it up for all the new skins, guys. Let me know which one you guys think is the best for Spiritborn. I think this one's the best. I actually like this one, but it, it, again, I don't really feel like it fits the Spiritborn. But also, look at the way my character looks right now. I like this one. <laughs> like, this this skin that we have is like the default. Like, well, it's like one of the earlier ones that you can get. I just like it because of the chest. <laughs> it just looks like she doesn't have anything, which is definitely good. Anyways, that's going to wrap it up. Those are the new skins for Vessel of Hatred.